Hi beauties, it's Jean Persani with Beauty and the Stamper and you guys, we did a 99 cent tree haul today. I wasn't gonna go, but one of you beauties sent me an adorable, adorable DIY that I will be showing you in the future. And then I went to go get the two things for the DIY and I ended up buying $40 worth of stuff. So let's go ahead and let me show you what I got. Oh, and I only got one of the things for a DIY and I'm probably not gonna DIY this one. I'm gonna keep it myself, I'll show you. First things first, I did find this lovely hula hoop that has glitter and then this pink ribbon wrapped around it, super cute. I'll be using that for a future DIY. Uh, also, this drain clog remover. This is not for a DIY. This is for hair that gets like trapped in the sink and like whoop. These work pretty good. So for 99 cents, good deal. What else? Oh, this is another yucky one. I guess we're starting with the yucky stuff first because I got this duster. We have, there's so much dust that gets all around the house because we live, uh, first of all, we live in Arizona, and then on a golf course, there's this little thing. I don't know what it's for. What do you think this is for? I don't know. There's maybe <laughs> to turn on the duster, and then when you're done dusting, you turn it off. I have no idea. If somebody can tell me what this is for, because it doesn't seem to do anything. Not really. Is there a light? That'd be funny if this was a light, but it's not. It's just a little holder. So anyways, I got this duster. And then, oh, I picked up these. Okay, aren't these cute? Just a, all alone in the little vase. These are two items. One is these flowers. Well, look how pretty these flowers are. They're like so cute. And then look at the vase really pretty unless it's a candlestick I don't know but just like that is super cute so I've got that and then I picked up oh you know who was with me Denise was with me she's the one who bought the hair clogger and some mushrooms <laughs> oh and some mozzarella cheese She's over here explaining why she buys mozzarella cheese at the 99 cent store. I picked up another one of these candlesticks. Well, I call it a candlestick. That's because I'm gonna use it as a DIY and I always use candlesticks as a DIY. I love these, you guys, if you see these, grab them. They're so much taller than the candlesticks we normally use. What else, what else? Oh, I picked up. Look at this tray, that's super cute. I love the buffalo check. And it says it's the most wonderful time of the year. Really, really pretty. Um, very Christmassy. I also picked up two ornaments. This one, can you see that like rainbow effect? And then your traditional colors and it's got some glitter on there but not really any fallout, which is not, oh, there's a little bit of fallout when you do that. But picked up those two. Also, I know Dollar Tree has been saying they're gonna have these signs and some of you have seen them, but they're just craft signs, wooden craft signs with words on them. So I picked this one up that says believe, and I'm sure we'll do something with that. Uh, I have another bag, and then I'll show you what I went in for. You guys, I got suckered in by the stickers. So I got, is it two of the same? No, I got one of these gems, which are really teeny tiny. And then these bigger ones. So you can see the two sizes there. And then, these glitter letters. There's eight sheets with all the different letters on them. So glittery, 
yellow and or not yellow gold and silver what else did I grab here oh they have these great scents this is pumpkin harvest and so I picked those up oh, I picked two of them up they work in the glade ones you guys so I have a couple of those glades normally I love the bath and body but they're expensive I'm sad I'm trying to save a little bit of money I know going to the 99 cent store and spending money is not saving money but um, I also got this flexible camp clamp and it was only a dollar 99 so I remember when 99 cent store was only 99 cents and then I picked up two packets of these clothes pins there's 50 each, so I don't know how many I'm going to need, but I thought I would go over and get extra ones. So I got 100 wooden clothespins, and then I could not pass this up, and I'm going to have to make a bigger one, because look at this. It says, leave a little Christmas sparkle. Can you see that? You guys, look at that. That is filled with sequins. Just 99 cents for those sequins are worth it, but then to come in to this beautiful little hanging for Christmas, super, super adorable. Okay, now for the one thing I went in for, this one was $1.99. This is the back, and then look at the front. Isn't that so pretty for $1.99? It is the same type of wood that like the Dollar Tree has. But look at that, and you guys should see the DIY that she did. That's what I ran down to get, but um, they only had this one, and I'm like, I really think I'm going to keep this one and put it up as is. So it's already so farmhousey. So I love it. I hope you guys... Oh, no, and then I picked up one more thing. One more thing. Oh, and this one was a splurge item. It was $5.99. But look at all of these little um, ornaments there. And then I don't know if you could see on here, there's some glitter, but it's got chunky glitter as well. And then um, gold and off-white. These are really pretty. And you guys, if you're not subscribed, make sure you subscribe because I'm going to be doing a DIY that is going to be super, super adorable. So, all right, beauties, I hope you have a wonderful day. Please give me a thumbs up. Make sure you subscribe and hit that bell so that you don't miss any of my future videos because I'm going to do some DIYs with some of the stuff I got, and it's going to be cute. And we've got lots and lots of Christmas DIYs coming. All right, you guys have a wonderful day, and I'll talk to you later. Bye!